How's it going? Uh, so <laughs> hey, what's up, everybody? So today we are talking about Nike shoes. They're like lo shoe Goliath. <laughs> <laughs> okay, long try. You go right. Hey, what's up? This is Max and Eddie from the Ride Report. Today we're talking about the shoe Goliath Nike. They already own basketball, pretty much, but forever they've ha they've been having the worst try. Hey, what's up today? Uh, hey, what's up, everybody? It's Max and Eddie from the Rad Report. Today, we're talking about the shoe Goliath Nike. They already own basketball, but forever they've been having trouble getting that youth hipster market. It's pretty good. Uh, okay. Fun. All right. How? Say, so finally, they've done it. Somehow they've gotten that part in. For probably the last two years, Nike has been trying to get somebody that they can't get, and that's skateboarders, people that don't like huge Nike massiveness that they are. But they've done it. They finally did it. I don't know how. I don't wear them, but everybody that I see has Nike's like skateboarding shoes now. They've managed to like get away from team sports and like runners. They bought big companies like Hurley and Surfing and when you go to Soho in New York, all you see is these hipster stores. They're filled with colorful Nike shoes. Yeah, they did it. Um, <laughs> okay, what can we say that will lead to a little skip? Yeah. Too? Um, so, all right, how about, so we went on the search out what people think about Nike just for b-roll yeah. okay so um all right <laughs> so we went on the search to see what people really thought about Nike or the kids okay so we went on a hunt to see what the kids really think about Nike okay what about um will you be able to talk to the girl extra yeah okay maybe take that as a take. Alright. Alright. Um. Shoes! Okay. So we're gonna go check out what. Alright. Just be like. So we're gonna go check out what Julie Kozak on the TV show Extra thinks about Nike. So we're gonna go check out what wardrobe lady. T uh. Yeah, just be like. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Don't say her name. Be like, we're. We're, uh, so we're gonna go check out Wardrobe Lady of the Stars and see what I gotta say. Wardrobe Lady of the Stars. Okay. All right. Celebrity wardrobe. So Stuff. we're gonna go check. Uh, so we're gonna go check out. So we're gonna go check out Celebrity Wardrobe Lady Julie Kozak to see. What, oh, that's so bad. <laughs> All right. Should I really say Julie? I don't think he's. She's not gonna hand. say Nike. She's not gonna do Nike. She doesn't have Nike. She's gonna do other trends. Just ask her something about Nike. Then, be like, hey, you like Nike? Yeah. I'll just do that intro when I'm with her. Okay, there's a Julie Kozak. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. So, pretty much what it gets down to, we don't wear Nikes. We don't have any friends that really wear Nikes, but they're everywhere. They're doing good with the hipsters for sure. So, uh, what, what are we saying? What's uh? Well, let's get. Okay, how about this? So, we don't know if this trend will really stay. Uh, it's t okay. So we don't really know if this trend will stay. It's kind of hard. It's just so hard to catch people that are like anti-establishment. For should we say something? Uh. I think that will trend. This trend will stay. All right. 
So we think pretty much and it's gonna last. Nike's not going anywhere anytime soon. They are a huge company, but they figured out how to grab those small markets, those small creative markets. I own Hurley board charts. They own Hur Hurley. There you go. <clears throat> I have I haven't bought anything Nike since I was about 12 years old, but I own Hurley, tons of Hurley stuff. Nike owns Hurley. Okay. Two and two together. Okay, let's do another one now. What are, what's our next? Let's switch or something. Switch. Fuck, I almost just fell off. <laughs>